your girl Jasmine back with another video on the channel today 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 we got some tea because Draymond Green and Jordan Poole at practice fighting like what like what the team that just won a championship right all hee hee and ha ha's having a good time as they should have you know what i'm saying they won a championship that's over with summer's over with playtime's over with season has started time to get back to work time to get back to business and do something else that basically is probably i'm not gonna say impossible but something that nobody would expect them to do to get five rings the same people together that's crazy the fact that they got four is crazy enough but anyway we're not talking about Steph, Clay, and Draymond, or Andre Iguodala. We're talking about Draymond and Jordan. <sighs> Let's see this, man. Let's see this. This is crazy. TMZ got the footage of the altercation between Jordan Poole and Draymond Green, and it doesn't look good for Draymond at all. First of all, my thing is, you know, TMZ be everywhere. But whoever leaked this footage need to be gone. Because obviously they're not with the organization. Obviously. You know what I'm saying? They did it for a come up and some money, that's for sure. But was it worth it? Totally uncalled for. You see Draymond talking. I can't tell if Jordan said anything back. Look at the coach. Coach already walking over there. Ooh. He punched the mess up out of him. See, as he was walking over there, Jordan should have been like, come on, bro. You know what I'm saying? You know, because when people get into that personal space, it's time to be like, all right, what you trying to do? Like, what's up? Like, back up. Like, but you wouldn't expect your brother and a leader of the team to react that way. That's the thing. Because Jordan probably is like, yeah, Draymond talks a lot. But at the end of the day, he's my brother and a leader of this team, somebody he may look up to. He ain't gonna do all that. And the fact that Draymond got out of character and did that, it's not looking good, Draymond. It's not looking good at all. That was crazy. So there you guys have it. Jordan Poole didn't look threatening at all. That was all on Draymond. There's a difference between trash talk and that. To That's crazy. So now we're going to see the comments from other players. See what they had to say about this interaction. With Isaiah Thomas saying, He definitely shouldn't have had his hands down. But IT. I'm going to keep it 100% real. If you my teammate, I'm not thinking you coming with that energy no matter. That's why I just said, bro. That's what I just said. Same here, IT. Like for real. Because you my teammate. You my brother. We just won a whole championship together. We had this crazy, we was on a team the whole, you know what I'm saying? Like, this chemistry should be A1. You feel me? They didn't make too many different changes to where the chemistry should be all over the place. So it's like, what was really said for him to be triggered that way to come up on me? Like, to come up on him like that? No matter what. No matter what. Right, you can you shit might, talk you, all you day, but like... to be swinging? You hit me like we didn't know each other. Yeah. So, that Facts. Ain't that ain't it. Like you some dude off the street. Where we from, yeah, you gonna you gonna put your hands up no matter if somebody walk up on you. I get that. But you in the NBA practice, you ain't thinking you ain't even thinking twice that's happening. Man. At all. And IT followed up by saying, but I ain't in the practice and I didn't hear what was being said. So I'ma leave that alone. Kendrick Perkins said Beyond that being a sucker move, Draymond needs to know what he did to Jordan Poole as a man, the Warriors as a team, and his own legacy. Mm. Leadership is more than holding your teammates accountable. Mm. You got to check yourself, too. Carry on. That was a good one, Kendrick. That was a good one. And I like how how they coming out saying stuff because, you know, some some athletes be too scared to say something. Trey Young said, Draymond is trying to get to L.A. Evan Fournier said, there is no way you can get back to being teammates after a punch like that. Facts. And he also said... Question, do you consider this a sucker punch? Ooh, do y'all? Was it? Mm. John Morant posted the eyes emoji. 
Reggie Miller said, how in the heck was that Draymond Jordan Poole video leaked? That's an in-house video. Man, there better be some heads rolling. Y'all are the world champs, and y'all have an inside snitch? Facts. That's Richard crazy. Jefferson said, I'd fire my entire video staff. Facts. David West said, fire whoever leaked that video. Got a whole bunch of mo who can't be trusted. Everybody wrong. As soon as Dre started walking towards Jordan Poole, somebody was supposed to get in front of him. Looks like the video guys and support staff got more heart than some of them chumps on the sideline. It low key looked like half the staff and players was like, he ain't about to do nothing. Like, he just talking, he's being Draymond. But when you saw that other coach following Draymond behind him, that coach knew that Draymond was about to do something. You know what I'm saying? I feel like, I don't know. Even after he got rocked, like, uh, it, they, a lot of people didn't go running over there. Like, it was just like the few people who were standing right there. I don't know. The whole situation was weird and it was a lot. It's too much going on. And with that altercation, that's going to set the season off to a bad, rough start. You know what I'm saying? And I already know it's going to be some troubles because, like um, Fonter said, there's no way. There's no way the chemistry is going to be the same. No way. The team, you know what I'm saying? There's no Justin way. Anderson said, How much was that bag to release that video to TMZ? Facts. I'm taking all guesses. Had to be a lot. Kyrie Irving said, No more forgive and forget. Only remember and teach. Festus said, I'll say this, fighting happens, fighting in practice happens, fighting in games happen. There's no way anyone oh, wins a championship without some fighting them. This is a new one. It's always happened. Stop overreacting. Mm. Jake Paul said, Draymond, I got 10 mil for you to get in the ring on the next Most Valuable Promotions pay-per-view. Who you want? Jake Paul Flight is trying to reach out to somebody. Draymond a menace. Kelsey Plum said, Also, on a more serious note, I just saw the video of... Draymond at practice, the Warriors, and I have thoughts. One of my biggest things is like I'm not condoning anything. Who does Kelsey play for? There is no such thing as privacy anymore. No, it's really and not. You can't trust nobody. It's gotten to a point where, man, we just air out everybody's dirty laundry, everybody's dirty laundry, just for some clicks. Like we all don't have problems of our own. Like. Facts. What happened to being sacred, keeping it in the locker room, keeping it in the family, keeping it in the relationship? Like, golly, I just, for me, like, you know, in life, things are going to get heated. Relationships are going to get, relationships are going to get tough. We're going to make mistakes. But man, like, we just got to film everything, share everything, tell everything. Like, it's like vomit. It's, to me, I just, it's disgusting. Steven Jackson. So do y'all think that, if it didn't get leaked, do y'all feel like it still would have been hashed out between them? But now that it is leaked, it's probably never going to get hashed out, right? I can't. I want to hear y'all opinions on it, especially my basketball fans. I want to hear that. Said, what y'all think? What up, world? No, I've never been in a, t in a fight with a teammate. Stop asking. Never have. Never got that mad at a teammate. We had arguments. And it happens in practice, right? Right. But not to the young guys. I, me and Draymond had a little conversation about something else last night, about some other issue we had, and uh, and to clear some stuff up between me and him. But I told him he got to go to pool and fix that. If he want to fix it, Jordan Poole don't benefit from this at all. And there's no reason to sucker punch a young fella. You know what I'm saying? But I told Draymond like, last night, he got to fix that situation with Poole. You know what I'm saying? Because he don't benefit from it at all. He got to be the big bro and go over there and tell her, bro, look, I spazzed out. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Da, 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 da. But you never hit the little homies like that Facts. in practice. All your teammates, man. You never do that. I've never done that, bro. Never done that. And you get into it. It happens sometimes. Y'all get into it. But the young fella, nah, you don't do that. Michael Rappaport said, I'm going to tell you exactly what happened. Bro, I ain't going to hold you. I can't. I don't. I can't. I can't. Sometimes I can't listen to him because sometimes he just does stuff for, like, clickbait. Like, you're not an athlete. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like, how are you having this much say? Um, are you the rest of the video? Okay. So, yeah, he is. And lastly, Iggy said, what we not going to do is talk crazy about my young fella Jordan Poole. Great character kid. Miss me with all that other bullshit straight from the source. Mm. And it's family business with my bro Draymond too. Let me know down in the comments below your thoughts on this whole situation. Uh, 
That's crazy. Um, I kind of agree with Kelsey was saying, you know, certain stuff got to stay in house. People do too much for clicks, views, money. Um, it's kind of sad because you're with an organization who's doing great things with the organization. Why let outsiders or other people, you know what I'm saying, like change that dynamic or that mindset or something good that's going on? Um, you know, how people would love to have that job being a film recorder for the Warriors, you know, like, or NBA team in general, like, that's an amazing position to be in, but um, it's very unfortunate that this got leaked, this got dropped, because it's going to cause a lot of chaos, a lot of problems, a lot of controversy. I'm glad to see, like, other veterans sticking up, like Andre Iguodala is going to be interested to see what Curry has to say, it'll be interesting to see what Draymond's response is besides just an apology, because obviously Draymond has a big platform, he has a podcast, he does a lot of stuff outside of basketball, it'll be interesting to see what he says in response. Um, and also how the Warriors will just gel back together the remainder of the season. Um, On-court chemistry, off-court chemistry, we sell she. See. But y'all got to let me know what y'all think down below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and push that notification bell. With that being said, see you guys next video.